It is now January 2021 and the last YouTube video I made was back in the summer for my Rogue Plate unboxing but I wanted to do another workout vlog since it's so much I guess has changed since my last workout vlog. I am back in my gym in Salisbury. I had my carport set up this past summer during the COVID pandemic to work out at home. My gym is back open here, so I try to come when like nobody's around, so that way I don't have to wear a mask when I'm working out or lifting. But I'm also back in my gym in Virginia training in DC once to twice a week. I am currently a few weeks out from my next meet. I am doing the Baltimore Open 2021. No, I'm not doing the Baltimore Open. I am doing the Rosedale Open 2021. I originally was gonna do the Baltimore Open because that seems to be a meet that I do well at every single year. I have posted a couple of vlogs of me doing the Baltimore Open. This year, however, the Rosedale Open is our team designated meet instead of the Baltimore Open, so I'm gonna be doing that one. It is on January 30th. It is January 3rd, it is a Sunday, and I am here doing my heavier lifts of the week. I currently train four days a week. Uh, I tried to do five days over the summer when I was home more, but I couldn't really recover well from doing five days a week, so I went back down to four days. I am working with a coach on my team who does a more customized program, I would say. Since I've been lifting for as many years as I've been lifting, I needed a more tailored program to how I was lifting. So I'm kind of paying attention to like the little technique flaws that I had. I overarch in my snatch extension. I arch a lot in my jerks from my cheer background. So like little teeny technique tweaks I've been trying to fix. It is week eight of my program of 12, so I'm pretty deep into this program, but it has been a great program. Overall, this year, I think I've gotten a lot stronger. I've gotten a lot more technically sound working with my PT and my massage therapist. Overall, I'm just moving better. So I'm pleased at where I'm at going into this meet. I honestly have no expectations going into it just because I have literally not competed since January 2020. I had plans to do a couple competitions last year that obviously didn't happen because of the pandemic. So I just kind of continued training and again, harping on my technique, little things like that, getting stronger, getting my nutrition dialed in. I'm still competing in the 64 weight class. I'm around 62 right now. I don't really obsessively track my macros, but I log what I eat every day. So I have an idea of how much I'm eating and how much protein I'm getting in because if I've noticed if I don't get enough protein in my workouts suffer so I've kind of just been holding steady where I'm at and I my weight has naturally gone down as I've tracked what I'm eating it's kind of weird to say but when I wasn't tracking I was eating a lot of snacks I wasn't getting enough protein in so if I track I tend to usually my weight tends to go down. So right now I'm at 62-ish and all my weigh-ins have been in the 62s. So I feel really good about my weight going into this meet. Like I said, my training is really good. I'm happy to be back in the gyms in Salisbury and Virginia. And yeah, I just kind of wanted to give a little update before I kind of jump into this workout vlog. I know this intro is a little longer than I wanted to. It's been a hot minute since I've actually sat down and talked to the camera and talked about like my training, where I'm at, my nutrition. But yeah, that's kind of where I'm at. I mean, Christmas, New Year's, it was kind of a struggle to try to work in getting my days in while also still preparing for a meet. So my fingers are crossed this meet is going to happen. I'm preparing after that meet to do the North American series. It was supposed to be in person at the Arnold, but 
the Arnold got canceled, so now it's going to be virtual. So I'm trying to qualify for a virtual competition. I know it sounds kind of weird, but I'm trying to still stay on track with my competing goals with not competing as much last year and everything that happened last year. So I'm trying to start this year on a positive note and hopefully it's a good year. So let's get into the workout. <laughs> Have it all, rip our memories off the wall All the special things I bought They mean nothing to me anymore But to you, they were everything we were They meant more than every word Now I know just what you love me for Take all the money you want from me Hope you become what you want to be Show me how little you care, how little you care, how little you care You dream of glitter and gold My heart's a little in stone Show you how little I care Diamonds leave with you You're never gonna hear my heart break Never gonna move in dark ways Baby, you're so cruel My diamonds leave with you Material love will fool me When you're not here, I can't breathe Think I always knew My diamonds leave with you Think I'm not Think I'm not Think I'm not here, I can't Think I'm not here, I can't breathe 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 Think I'm not here, I can't breathe
done my workout and it took a good solid two to three hours to do closer to three three and a half actually but it is now dark outside and I think I had a good lift for being my heavy day I'm glad I got to show some of my lifts that didn't go perfect my snatching I kind of felt wonky in the new shoes so I had to switch shoes work down work back up but my last set of 49 was butter and I'm very happy with that 49 snatch double my clean and jerks I was pretty tired and it felt very heavy when I got there but my jerks were a little little wonky I'd say they're not the best jerks I've done but they weren't awful but I am pleased with this day four that I did I wanted to film a workout vlog before I jumped into my meat vlog that'll probably happen in a few weeks but I thought it was a really good lift to film and it was a lot of fun and I missed vlogging my workouts so thanks for watching this YouTube video and I will see you guys in the next one